If you're using Docker on Windows and you're getting this unexpected WSL error, this is probably due to you not having virtualization turned on. Let's go ahead and do that. We're gonna jump to step two before we do step one because we're gonna have to restart the computer anyway. So first, let's go to the start menu, type in control panel, under control panel, go to programs, and we wanna click on turn on Windows features. And here we're gonna go down to Hyper-V and we're gonna turn on just everything with Hyper-V. Just turn it all on, it's fine. It's gonna say save changes and ask if you wanna restart. So let us restart. And when you're restarting, you wanna also go into the BIOS during that time. Now that we're in the BIOS, we're gonna go down to advanced and we're gonna to go to the advanced tab and we're gonna look for CPU configuration. And then we're gonna turn on SVM mode if you're using AMD, which I am. Then we're gonna save changes and restart. It will apply all the changes for the Hyper-V. Now when we click on Docker, it opens up just fine. I hope this video helped you. If it did, hey, leave a sub, leave a comment, leave a sub, and I'll see all of you in the next video. Bye.